Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Michaela, and welcome. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you what, how I like to use my gym. I'm actually here in my gym today at my rink, and I'm gonna show you the equipment that I like to use for what and how I take advantage of it because most people don't have it at home, and you know what I mean. So today, we're gonna start off with a simple warm up. I'm gonna lead you through um, part of my, it's like part of my four of four on, on, on ice training and then part of it like before working out and you know. So to start, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna walk forward and I'm just gonna pick up knee to chest and walk. Knee to chest, walk. Knee to chest. Skater jumps. So one, two, three, run. 
Other side. Alright, so I'm feeling pretty warm. And I'm gonna start with we're gonna start with the first circuit. Um every circuit is gonna be well what I mean by circuits, I'm gonna do three to four exercises. And then I'll repeat three, the, 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 like if I do squats, then I do push-ups, then I do, I don't know, like a squat jumps, and then like a stretch. I'm going to repeat that whole thing five times. That was just amazing. But to start, what I am going to grab is, today I have this band here. I already tied it onto my bar, but I'm going to move it so I can show you guys. It's not too... Heavy. It's long, so it's just one of these regular little bands that you can tie with something or have someone hold for you if you need. Today I'm going to tie it to the ballet bar in the in the work in the actually I am in the ballet rooms. Um, perfect. So you can double it up if yours is really really thin. Mine was too thick doubled up, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to wrap it around my hand a couple times if I need to make it um, stronger. So, yeah, so now I have, or you can just step further away, or you can grab, like, pull it in and step closer. So, what first we're going to do is, I'm just going to pull it in a little bit because mine's a little loose. What we're going to do with this band is we're going to, I'm sure if you think your skin you know, makes sense, but we're going to pull it into the right, and then pull it into the right. And if you add a little bit to the eyes, have the rhythm, like the snap of the jump and the spin, like the snap of the right. If you're lefty, you grab it with your right hand, but I grab it with my left hand because it's kind of hard to take off. Unless you're doing like an axe or something, you wouldn't take off. But like Sam Cow, which will do butts, but almost all of them are pretty similar, some are a little more out of front, but the idea is the same that you stay to the right. Yeah, kind of get that snap. Okay, yeah. So I'm going to do this 15 times and then we'll, I'll show you another. I'll do that one. I'll do that 
Thank you. 
take the bigger box off the small box. Wait, pivot. Move the little one on top of the little one. Now, if you're doing what I'm doing, with the same size box, so pretty close on top of the other. Be careful if they don't move because that could be, um, you could fall. No, 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 not good. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this box. And so, actually, you know what? We're not going to put these on top of each other instead. I need to grab myself another box. Alrighty guys, so unfortunately it doesn't look like they have another small box in this rink, they only have two. Um, it's okay though, we'll deal. I mean, you can always just still work on your height, landing with straight legs, straight, or you don't land with straight legs, because if it moves, especially your wood on wood, you slide, you're done. <laughs> but, um, so how we're gonna do this is, you guys can fail this, sorry. I'm gonna jump up two foot, then I'm gonna jump down one foot and I'm gonna pop up. So I'm gonna go jump up. And then I'm gonna ah, oh, this is the further part. And then I'm gonna with the same foot I'm gonna jump off and jump up. So this is what it looks like in motion. And I put a little spin on the end of it. You don't have to do that, honestly. If you, you, you don't want to do that, I mean, it's not gonna, it's not gonna take away the, like the exercise. The exercise is still gonna help you, it's still gonna do that. So I'm gonna, I'm not, I mean, there's no really number for do it, and not how many times to do the sequence. Just like do it, take a break, squat or do it again. Um, and by the end, you should feel that your height, especially on the big box, has improved. So how this is set up is ideally you would go bigger, little, and tiny. But because I don't have that many boxes to like have, you want going at a slant. So you want to go really tall for two feet, well not really really tall, like push yourself for two foot. And then you want to push yourself on one foot and then hop down and just hop onto the last one. Like the last one should be really easy. It should be you should be able to do it like this. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna I'm just gonna do it. Feel free to count as many times as I do it and then do it. But honestly, just do it the way how many times you feel is necessary. And make sure you're switching feet. Like when you you, you can go like five times one foot and five times another foot because when you jump off the two foot box, you're gonna jump off and onto the one foot. So you want to make sure you're training each foot equally. Throwing one foot stronger than the other. Because you're jumping off of both feet, remember, on the ice. <laughs>
that actually was harder than I thought. But I did a couple. But now what I really was worried about stuff to do is what I'm going to do is, is when you're doing this, make sure you jump way far enough from the box. Because you probably saw I kicked my box at one point. Luckily, I didn't wait. <laughs> what we're going to do is you're going to jump, 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 and rotation. So I'm going to do like one and a half to start. Or one, just to show you guys. It's going to be one. So it kind of gives you the momentum that you would need on the ice, but instead of having the speed, you have the jump. So it kind of helps you, gives you the same idea. One more time. Jump, 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 jump. Okay, so you can also go jump, jump, jump. That's a little harder because it doesn't give you as much time to like stand up your body in the right position. Like you get your here, unless you're like, you're here, you go jump. Yeah, see, so even. That's another plus, because if you jump that far enough, you can jump a little further next time. So you go, jump, jump. That actually isn't too bad. Like if you set yourself up, not too bad. Um, do whatever you want. I'll probably do a couple of each. And then we'll move on to some non-jump exercises. <laughs> going to the, oh, sorry guys, gym part of my, the gym part of the gym. Well, yeah, that was the ballet room. This is the gym. It's a little bit of a mess. I'm sorry guys, they're redoing it. They're tearing out some equipment, so it's like everywhere. But what I want you to grab is, yoo-hoo, that's turned off. 
I want you to grab, ooh, they don't have my weight, dang. Grab a two and a half to five pound weight. Well, no, I'd go with like a, a two or a three pound weight. So I've got a two and a half and a three pound weight. Let me grab my three pounder. But basically what you're gonna do, I'll just show you guys. Uh, here, watch me in the mirror. Because otherwise I can't show you. You're gonna put it behind your head and you're just gonna go up and down, up and down. Make sure you're not arching your back. Make sure you're tucking your pelvis. I'm sorry guys for the shaky camera. Just go up and down, up and down, okay? So, my three pounder. I think that's a little light. So, um, I'm gonna use the three pounder. And, what can I set you guys down? Sorry, it's a little hard finding a place to set down a camera. Um, let's see. Let's see. Uh, no, sorry guys. But you know what? Actually, what I could do is I can set you guys down right here. I apologize for the pole that's in the way, but there, I'm going to stay on the side. So put it behind your head, actually I'll go this way, this way, and just lift it up. Ah, I'm really sorry guys. Up and down, up and down. I'm going to do it 10 times each side. total so two sets each side but because I'm only using my right hand today I'm gonna do just two sets but pause the video and do your other, other hand so set two mm -hmm. have a yoga mat um, what I'm gonna use is there we go guys sorry this is a little tricky to set up what I'm gonna use is okay there's a little bit of a bar in the way but don't mind it please guys I'm gonna use one of these things I don't know what they're called I'm sure you've seen them before <laughs> Come on. So I'm gonna use one of these. So actually, you know what? I'm gonna put you guys right. Oh. Uh. You guys see me? Damn. What that? Too low. Alrighty, guys. Sorry, I figured out where to place my camera. So, I'm gonna clear, move this out of the way. Oh yeah. Grab my benchy thingy. Um, do this on a yoga mat if you have one. I honestly wouldn't recommend using this, but I am because it's the only thing I have. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And I don't wanna be dirty. So first, what I'm going to do is put your feet up like this, put one, I'm sliding off, rats, okay, and you're going to pick up, put your hands behind your ears, not behind your head, don't, don't help your, don't use your hands to like lift your neck like this or whatever, use your core, 
and your head just comes along with the ride. So I'm gonna go opposite, um, knee to opposite elbow, like this. Um, 10 times, then we'll swap, and then we'll do another core. enjoyed this video if you did make sure to give it a thumbs up hit the subscribe button down below and don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you know every time I post a new video also let me know what video you guys want to see next and your request might become my command <laughs> alrighty bye guys <laughs>